Ever wondered how sailors used to navigate long before GPS? Or what happens when your electronic systems suddenly fail in the middle of the ocean? That's when dead reckoning becomes your best friend. In this video, I'll explain what dead reckoning is and how to apply it step by step like a real navigator. Let's set our course and dive right in. Dead reckoning is a method of estimating a ship's current position based on a previously known position, your course steered speed and time traveled. In simple terms, you draw your course and track your movement, even without landmarks, radar or GPS. We often use it between fixes or when visibility and electronics are unavailable. To perform dead reckoning, you need four things. Number one, previously known position and time. This is your starting point or last known position marked with the exact time. It's the reference from which all DR calculations begin. Number two, Course. The direction your vessel is heading, measured in degrees true, usually from the gyro compass. Number three. Speed. The vessel's speed through the water, typically expressed in knots nautical miles per hour. Number four. Time. The amount of time the vessel has been traveling on that course and speed, usually measured in hours. With these, you use the formula. Distance equals speed times time. Then, plot your new position on the chart based on the course and distance. Let's say at 0, 0800 hour, your vessel is at position. Latitude 12 degrees 12 minutes and 30 seconds north. Longitude 123 degrees 57 minutes and 6 seconds east. You're steering 045 degrees true at 5 knots. Find the DR at 0900 hours using the formula distance equals speed times time. Distance equals 5 knots times 1 hour. The total distance is 5 nautical miles. To plot the DR position, the following steps should be followed. Number 1. Plot the initial position and note the time. Number two, draw the course line from the initial position and extend it in the direction of travel. Number three, measure five nautical miles using the latitude scale. Number four, Plot the DR position at 0900 hours along the course line, and that's it. You now have your DR position at 0900 hours. DR isn't perfect. It doesn't account for currents, wind, steering errors, and engine trouble. This means your actual position might differ, but DR gives you a solid estimate. That's why we improve it later with fixes or estimated positions.